uh, my body was like numb and tingling and, and I couldn't speak. I think I also had a little bit of, uh, it was almost like, it felt like kind of a reset, like on your computer, um, where I just temporarily, I just like, what's happening right now? There's never a good time to have a seizure, but while flying a 12 ton US military Chinook, nearly unthinkable. While Clayton Burkhart landed safely that day, his real fight was just starting. I thought it was having a uh, stroke. It wasn't a stroke, it was a brain tumor. Multiple surgeries followed to remove it, including one brain surgery that happened while he was awake. After intense speech therapy, the moment he could, Burkhart got right back to his online studies at ASU, which he had started while serving, but with a new mission inspired by the doctors who treated him. But some of the tests they did were, were pretty, uh, pretty crazy, very interesting. Now he's graduating with a degree in electrical engineering, hoping to one day advance MRI technology. His message for any other hopeful college grads facing tough challenges. Just because you're going through that doesn't mean that you there's not something on the other side. Because not even a terminal diagnosis is going to stop him.